What's up, y'all? I got a family to feed, so let's get into this tea. We about to get into um, Bluefus and Jaden. They had a meet and greet, and they apparently stood their people up. This is what these people are saying, so let's get it. This is our meet and greet obligation. Do us like that? Like that like that. Oh my God! Everybody from the meeting ring just got stood up. Wow. Go get his ass. That's what I'm talking about. Go get his ass. I would have been mad as hell too if you got a lot or scheme to get where you want to be. Well, yeah, um, two months ago. Something else. Blue. <laughs> oh, he said no videos. Oh, my God. That's crazy. Is it more to this? I ain't gonna lie, y'all. That's trifling as hell. I mean, what would be the point of having a meet and greet just to not have the meet and greet? Okay, so this, no, 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 no ma'am. This was the tweet. If you got a liar scheme to get to where you want to be, then then wasn't meant to be. If you got a lie or a skim to get to where you want to be, then wasn't meant to. Let that go. It took an hour for her to figure it out. Yeah, that was terrible. Um, I don't know if she's saying the people lying and scheming. I don't know if they're saying if she's saying that because she's saying she ain't lying and scheming. Girl, I don't know. I would not pay for a meet and greet to see them though. I wouldn't. No, hell no. For what? What are we gonna get out of it? Anyway, uh, Blueface and Jaden TMZ hold the line. I mean, is there any <laughs> chance that you guys can reconcile? You know, put the engagement back on the table. You guys are cute. <laughs> Maybe. No, I mean, no, I'm yeah, chilling. I'm chilling right now. You're right right chilling right now. Okay. Getting this money out. You feel me? Getting oh, the money. money. Okay. Hello. I know you guys are both the founders of Milf Music. Are we gonna add any more milfs to the to the mix? Are we gonna maybe? Is there any? I'm artists? not adding any milfs. No uh, milfs, just you. I'm not adding okay. any milfs. <laughs> All right. I want to know what projects are you guys both working on right now? Uh, any new music? I, I no, shit. I would love new music. Love. All right, I'm coming for a plaque. That's it. That's all. Yeah, coming for a plaque. Yeah, I'm coming for a plaque. That's it. All right. Yeah. Okay. And then, Don't I mean, vote. do you have a message? Because I know your song Barbie, you know, is on the billboard right now. Do you have any message for the haters right now? Man, the haters. Fuck the haters. I'm coming for that plaque. And when I get it, I hope they all suck my dick. This my dick. This my dick. <laughs> no. I mean, you recently announced that you're single. I mean, is there any <laughs> chance that you guys can reconcile? You know, put the engagement back on the table. I ain't gonna lie. She kind of popped a big one with that. <clears throat> uh, I'm glad she know how to kind of speak. Y'all, whether y'all like it or not, I mean, the music is kind of doing what the music is supposed to do. That don't mean you're supposed to like it. You know what I'm saying? But... The music is very well doing what it's supposed to do. Let's see what this is about, because I keep seeing this. We looking for love, man. Hold on, hold on. Hold on. Come. Single ladies, if you out there, we looking for love, man. You know my brother, don't come fuck with him, man. You know. Send the address, baby. Send the address. You accept the applications if you wanna. If you wanna, you know. Get right before you get left. Single ladies, if you out there, you looking. Single ladies, if you out there looking for whoever, you sent him as the spokesman. <laughs> I mean, not only that. Why is he trying to get him? That's crazy. I ain't gonna lie, my boy be thirsty sometimes. <laughs> He be real thirsty sometimes. Okay, that was old. All right, y'all. Yeah, let me know what y'all think about that down in the comment section below, bro. Um, quite frankly, 
I think that uh, she mean what she's saying when she say get a plaque because she knows those numbers. So the thing is, I, if she wasn't doing those numbers, I don't think she would say any some blasphemy like that. You know what I'm saying? Clearly, she probably knows the numbers. This is the next thing we're going to get into. Um, Bluefoot is hiding from, uh, what's his name? Snapdog. Hold on. Let me go to his page. Snapdog. Damn. Snapdog 207, I think. Snapdog 27. All right, y'all. So this guy right here, he can really fight. Like, I'm talking, he got hands. Okay? Hands. But anyway, Blue, he posted this the other day. I know I'm late, but whatever. Better late than never. He posted this and let the world speak what fight y'all want to see. Uh, you know, more comments below, I guess. Not Carlissa telling uh, Dre this was his fight. But anyway, Blueface ain't responding to him at all. And honestly, I think he's not responding to him because he don't feel like it's going to be no money in it. Real shit. I think that's what I'm glad that we ain't fucking hide, nigga. Boy, ain't no way, boy. Ain't no way, boy. Ain't no fuck. That was crazy. Fucking way, boy. Listen. It's safe to say that Snapdog got the whole motherfucking industry scared when it comes to this boxing shit, man. Y'all know I've been calling niggas out. Y'all know I've been on this boxing shit. No, I don't smoke. I don't drink. I don't do nothing, nigga. I be a red bull, nigga. Get here. But now I'm just as bad, gang. Put that shit broke. down. Like with the blue face shit, man, they be asking, hey, can Snap Dog sell seats? Or the, it, it ain't worth fighting him. Nigga, what the fuck do you mean? I sell out seats, nigga. Oh. And stop playing like, because I lost my Instagram. I'm like, oh, what Snap Dog at? Man, come on, man. Y'all know, nigga. I'm one of the hottest motherfuckers for real, nigga. From my city, nigga, and put in work with no motherfucker. <coughs> Y'all let me know where he from. I have no fucking idea. Fucking label, nigga. That fight will go crazy. Y'all talking about. If he fight somebody else, it will make more money. No, it wouldn't make more money. I'm going to tell you why it wouldn't make more money. Because none of these rappers, they don't fight. They don't box. So if I Nah, it'll make money because it, it, Blueface is trying to pick up somebody basically he can beat. They don't want to see that because that rapper's going to get beat. A rapper get in there and box with a nigga who's been boxing for three years consistently. But I feel him on that. They're going to look bad as shit. Yeah. So people going to pay their money and see that person can't fight and be like, bro, this shit was a ripoff. I'm not coming to no shit else like this. So why not get in there with somebody who been boxing just like you and who really do this shit just like you? Y'all niggas already agree, but it's at the end of the day, bro, we need it. We know what's going on, bro. I guarantee you, nigga. We they even agreed and he still didn't do it. It's crazy. You do the fight in L.A. I guarantee you, nigga, all my, all my close friends, nigga, that I fuck with, I, I guarantee you they'll pop out. These niggas ain't going to pop out for no other fight, bro, because it ain't going to be worth. If I call Chris Brown and say, hey, big bro, you popping out to the fight? He going to say, yeah. If I call Shaquille O'Neal and say, OG, you popping out to the fight? He going to say, yeah. If I say Snoop Dogg, you popping out to the fight? He going to say, yeah. If I say Meek Mills, you popping out to the fight? He going to say, yeah. Nigga, so many motherfuckers. If I say Boosie, you popping out to the fight? Here. He going to say, yeah. If I say Lamar, nigga, Lamar Jackson, the quarterback, you popping out to the fight? Yeah. Antonio Brown? Yeah. Oh. Bro, I got a whole A-list celebrities that will pop out to that bitch, to that bitch and sell a fucking crazy nigga. Everybody in L.A. will pop out in that motherfucker. So it's like, I don't want to hear all these excuses, man. I ask niggas for fights. Niggas know what it is. Niggas try to act like because I lost my Instagram. Niggas don't see shit. At the end of the day, it's not me. Do y'all realize no rapper can post anything about boxing without the world tagging me, bro? Everybody tag me. And I ain't even gonna hold y'all. This is my... Damn, I can't believe I did that. But he was just rambling anyway. This is my first time seeing Cuz. But he can really fight. I'll tell y'all that. Y'all check him out because um y'all know YouTube's sensitive. But he can really fight. Now, y'all think Blueface ducking him because he's scared to lose? That's the thing. And, like, for some reason, like, y'all think that I I think that Blueface can't get beat. That's cap. I was just saying NLE going to get whooped. But that's the truth. He can't fight. He hasn't been, and I mean boxing, but even street fighting is just bad. You know what I'm saying? So that's what I was saying, but that does not mean um, Blueface can just beat everybody. That's not what I said. So, Anyway, y'all let me know what y'all think about that down in the comment section below. I am done with this video. Love y'all. Appreciate y'all. Hey, yeah.